Hey guys, it's Vicki and I'm here at the Settlers Inn with Chef Kate and we're checking on the bees. So what are you doing today? Hey guys, so today we are feeding the bees. It's finally a warm day and even though it's February, it's about 50-ish degrees, that means the bees are coming out. And so all we did is um, I turned off the electric fence, huge point, make sure you turn off your electric fence. And then I just took the, the just the cover off and I fed them, I'm feeding them um, like a double thick simple syrup. So instead of a one to one ratio, it's a two to one uh, sugar to water ratio. And you just put it over top, you put a empty super on it or, and then you just throw the lid back on and that'll feed them probably a week, maybe two weeks, but they're probably pretty hungry. All right, that all sounds great. So what did they do in the spring? Um, so once it gets like warm enough to where like it's not like we've been freezing for so long, uh, the queen will start um, laying again and they'll start tending to the babies. And I have bought pollen patties, which is what they feed um, the baby bees. So bees themselves don't actually eat the pollen. They bring the pollen back to feed to the babies. And so I'll put the pollen patties in, they'll start, it'll kind of give them that oomph that they need instead of having to wait for all the beautiful flowers and stuff to bloom. And hopefully they'll really become prolific and then hopefully they won't swarm. But if they do swarm, you know, maybe we'll have another hive but you know anything's possible there the thing is is like it's important to remember even though there are bees they're they're still like they're wild animals like they are insects who do and will do what they please and we can only do so much so if they do swarm um the hive to the uh left of us they swarmed so they were a little bit smaller than the hive to the right and the hive to the right was the only one who gave us honey this year because they didn't swarm so you know we'll see how spring takes us but the pollen patties and the little food that we gave them now and as soon as it warms up again i'll check and give them more food that'll kind of give them the, what they need to you know survive winter and hopefully we'll be able to see them again in like a month or so all right that sounds great and i can't wait to try their honey in the spring and i'll see you guys next time at something